soon my plan to become mayor and destroy Tom and Ben Enterprises will be complete. <laughs> um, Uncle, don't you remember what just happened? Tom had a secret system to become mayor, but when it was stolen by you, it all came down to the mayor factor competition, and you did not win Tom one. I know, but it's not fair! I want to be mayor! Ow! Now my kicking leg hurts! This is the worst day of my whole life! <laughs> Ginger, I don't really need security. But check that guy over there. I'm on now, let's get down to business. Bob, 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 way ahead of you. We have to decide when I'm supposed to wear my mayor sash and when I should probably wear my mayor button. That's not what I meant by business. I'm talking about the minor civic infrastructure issues that urgently need to be dealt with. Whoa, 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 whoa. Look, I don't know what those words mean, but I do know that being mayor is about wearing sashes, cutting ribbons, and making sure everyone is happy, which they are. I'm not happy, Mr. Mayor. I'm tired, my shows weren't on last night, and earlier today I stepped on a bee. Sounds like a job for Mayor Tom. Let's see that foot. Tom, mm. no! Rhonda's complaints and feet have nothing to do with the mayor's responsibilities. Oh, yeah, you're probably right. Besides, no one is really happy. I mean, Joe the dishwasher has a hangnail, Lucy's laptop broke, oh, and Mar put a red sock with all the whites and ruined his laundry. I had no idea people were so unhappy. I have to do something about this. Ah! Citizens, I am your mayor and I want to put your simple minds at ease. I hereby promise that I will not rest until everyone in this town is happy. Yes, you heard that right, until everyone is happy. Tom, you can't promise that. Oh, right. That's not a promise. That's a guarantee. Oh, no! <laughs> thank you, thank you. Now you can return to putting food in your mouth. You heard the mayor! Everybody back to lunch! That means you, sir! Excuse me! I don't see a pep in your step. Why are you so unhappy? Hey, Tom. What's going on? Why are you screaming at strangers? Guys, a lot of people in this town aren't happy, and that means I'm not the mayor I promised to be. Tom, there's always going to be unhappy people in a town, and happy people, and angry people, and... That's why they call it a town. Not in my town. Not on my watch. Hey, you, what's your problem? Me? People keep yelling at me. Who's yelling at you? Oh. Ah, I see. Great, now I'm part of the problem. Tom, things aren't so bad. Look, there's a park concert right now featuring DJ Joy and the Magic Spider Band. There's gonna be tons of happy people there. I guess we could go check it out. I bet the mayor gets in for free. But who's gonna work the complaint booth until you get back? Okay, I'll do it. Come on, boys. See, Tom? There were happy people everywhere, even during the sad songs. Yeah, everyone was having fun and everyone was happy. If only there was some similar way to make the whole town happy. <gasps> Wait a minute. Research shows that you need three things to be a good mayor. F, U, uh, oh, and N. Uh. <laughs> fun. So, we're having a fun town party. What? Tom, fun is not going to address any of the underlying issues with our town civic infrastructure. Ben's right. Let's party. No! This party will make everybody happy. It's what a mayor's supposed to do. A mayor is supposed to... Hold on, I have a spreadsheet. 
Um, mm, mayor is supposed to dust the welcome sign, pull the dandelions from the sidewalk cracks, hand out big checks and cut ribbons with big scissors. You seem upset. Sounds like you need a party. An F-U-N town party. No, I do not. Come on, Ben. No. Oh, yeah? Then why are you wearing a party hat? <laughs> How did this get on my head? Quiet on the set, people. Hold on, work. All right, Tom. Action. Hello, town. It's time to face facts. Some of you are unhappy, and it's my duty to fix that with a town party. You feeling down about some broken traffic lights? Well, come get down with our laser lights. Worry that tap water tastes like rust? Well, dump that water and drink some party punch. We feel like our voice isn't being heard. Then turn up the volume on the karaoke stage. So come to the town party, yeah! yeah! <laughs> what? Excuse me, ma'am. You have permission to be here. <laughs> you know, it stays like this where a mayor is glad that he can do something great for this beautiful town. Gotta admit, it's a pretty great party. I know, the grocery store's giving away mermaid costumes. Mr. Mayor, Mr. Mayor! I know I complained before, but you put the fun in Mayor. And that's not just me talking, that's everyone saying. <laughs> Thanks, Rhonda. I officially proclaim you happy citizen of the day! <laughs> Whoa, happy citizen of the day? That's a great honor. And what do I get for this? Uh, the maraca. Well, I hope you're happy. I'm very happy. Wait a minute. This sounds like you're setting me up for something bad. Your out of control party is turning this town into a disaster. Is this guy bothering you? Got a churro. I'm not afraid to use it. Tom, I mean it. Look at the mess you've made. What? All I'm seeing are people who love their town. Like those dancers over there who are dancing on that garbage pile. Tom! That was a garden. All right. Well, hey, what about that cool merry-go-round over there with the tires that you sit on? That's an upside-down car. Oh. Is that smoke or a large number of fog machines working in unison? A little bit of both. What have I done? I have to fix this. Security 1-9, Mayor's on the move. We're gonna need air support. Who are you talking to? It's my tent. Jeez, you really ruined everything. Sir, I need you to stop partying. Hey, you're yelling at me again. Good thing I'm having so much fun at this party it doesn't bother me. Ugh. Rhonda, I need you to give me that maraca. Get out of here. I just became happy citizen of the day. You can't take that back. Rhonda, Rhonda, Okay, yeah, just one. Oh, man. Hey, Tom, why so blue? It's a town party. This town party is ruining the town, and I can't make it stop. <laughs> mm, oh, yeah, I see what you mean. People's hands are in the air, and they're waving them like they just don't care. I care because I'm the mayor. It's my job to care. But now I guess it's also my job to clean this up. Tom, these people aren't going to stop partying just because you start cleaning. I mean, if they see a broom, they're just going to put a wig on it and start dancing with it. This is it. Great idea. Let's go. Stop your dancing, citizens. I'm shutting this party down. And starting a new party, a cleanup party. Can you lead that conga line all the way to the dump? It would be my honor. Your honor. So it kind of seems like we're doing work. <laughs> Just dance it out. Well, this was almost a disaster. I guess it's not a mayor's job to make everybody in town happy. Unless you're Mayor Cheer from Mayor Cheer and the Smile Squad. 
Wait, I'm not sure if that's an actual show or just a toothpaste commercial. Yeah, besides, if there was no unhappiness, how would we know what happiness is? Huh, if you think about it, that's a really deep and smart thing I just said. So, you're welcome. So, Tom, now that this is under control, I assume you'll be referring to my spreadsheet of civic infrastructure issues for your next mayoral decision. No, Ben, I've learned my lesson. I don't think I'll be making a mayor decision for a long time. Ah! Seriously, can you believe how smart that thing I said was? Maybe I should be mayor. But that's a story for another day.